All right, so we want to talk a little bit about the tropics, and I'm here with meteorologist Robert Spetta because we've been talking a lot about what's going on out there, especially with this blob, because I know at least on my social media feed, mm. some people have taken probably what would be considered the worst case scenario you know, 10 days out and posting it and it looks scary and I'm going and I ran over to your desk the other day oh, and I was yeah. like, what is this? And, and I, so please explain to us why we don't need to panic. And I totally get that feeling because people see some of those those model guidances and that's why we call them model guidances because some of those long range guidances are forecast aids. Mm -hmm. uh, some show something so strong, some shows something kind of but weak. But it's still so early. That's the key thing, Katie. We don't have an area quite formed up out there. We are expecting something to move towards the Yucatan. Okay. Maybe move into the Gulf, but here, let's break this down uh, day by day. Okay, so this weekend is what we need to really watch. Yes, what we know now is heading into this weekend first, we got to see if something forms in the first place. Mm -hmm. We got to look at the cloud cover. We got to see if we get an area of low pressure. Okay. Then looking ahead, we got to see if these are two different scenarios that could be taking place. Okay. One maybe going east of the Yucatan, the other one rolling over towards the west. For us, the better situation would be towards the west. Right. Some of the guidance actually shows kind of something developing and maybe pushing off towards uh, Texas. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, some other guidance shows something getting a little bit stronger. And that's the worst case scenario yeah. that I saw. This yep. is some of the models are showing a full on hurricane here. That was yesterday, though. It's backing off a bit today. Good. And also, it depends on the timing of a trough coming in from the north. There are so many factors. That's why I kind of show this. Is it going to develop? Is it going to go around the Yucatan? Is it going to strengthen? Is mm -hmm. it going to get picked up by the trough? We got a week to watch this, Katie. So really this week, it, it, until something forms, it's hard to know what's going to happen. So you kind of got to wait for something to form. Exactly. First, we got to see if something forms, but for now, yeah, it's a moderate chance we're going to keep you posted. Okay, well, thank you for breaking mm -hmm. that down. I know it always makes me feel better after I talk I to try, you guys. I try. Hope it makes you guys feel better too.